All right, today I'm gonna to be showing you how to replace an engine coolant temperature sensor. Um, this will be the sensor right here. It's sitting on the front of the intake manifold on the passenger side um, valve cover right behind the alternator. Um, obviously, you're just gonna kind of pop this clip off, squeeze this guy right here, and then you're gonna get a 19 millimeter um, wrench. If you use a socket, you would have to take off the, the idle air control valve. We don't want to do that, so we'll just use this wrench. Now, before you take this off, coolant is going to come out. So be warned. Have like a rag hanging around. But since I have the sensor, I'm just going to do it real quick. Now you, now you want to go until there's about like two threads hanging around, hanging out, so you can see right there. Um, you want to get back to the original position that it was in. Um, and if you did get some coolant back in your temperature sensor, go ahead and just clean that off with. Uh, you could blow it some air, <clears throat> and then connect your connector right back in. Make sure there is no coolant. Again, make sure all that coolant's out. If not, you will short this out and you could damage something. Um, again, I hope this video helped you out. Go ahead and clear the codes or you can disconnect the battery. Um, that should reset the codes too as well. Um, hit the thumbs up, comment below, and then hit that subscribe button for more upcoming videos in the future. And if you want to see how to diagnose um, this problem, go ahead and click on my other video to diagnose coolant temperature sensor and thanks for watching.